Welcome back guys. Today we will be comparing two popular certifications in the defensive domain of cybersecurity. Yes, we will be comparing Blue Team Level 1 and CompTIA Security Plus. We will outline which one you should seek while pursuing a career as a cybersecurity analyst. Let's break down each certification and explore their key differences to help you determine which might be the best fit for your career in cybersecurity. Okay, let's start with CompTIA Security Plus. CompTIA Security Plus is a vendor neutral certification that provides foundational knowledge of cybersecurity principles, tools, and techniques. It is recognized worldwide as a standard for entry level cybersecurity roles. It focuses on basic cybersecurity concepts and principles such as cryptography, identity management, and network security. It's very ideal for those switching from IT or beginners entering the field of cybersecurity. Unlike BTL1, CompTIA Security Plus emphasizes foundational knowledge over hands-on skills as it focuses on conceptual understanding of basic cybersecurity concepts such as risk management, identity management and threats, attacks and vulnerabilities. Okay, when it comes to BTL1, Blue Team Level 1 is a certification focused on practical hands-on skills required for defensive cybersecurity roles. It is designed to equip learners with the knowledge and techniques to detect, analyze, and mitigate cyber threats. BTL1 covers incident response, phishing analysis, and more security information and event management. BTL1 teaches you practical skills for a security operations center analyst role. It's ideal for individuals aspiring to work in blue team roles, such as security operations center analysts or cybersecurity analysts. BTL1 course content contains more hands-on practical content than CompTIA Security Plus. In BTL1, you will learn hands-on skills with tools like Splunk, Wireshark, Autopsy, as well as command line tools in Linux used for incident response. All right, now it's time to talk about the exam format. Let's start with the exam format of CompTIA Security Plus. The CompTIA Security Plus exam includes a maximum of 90 questions. The exam features a mix of question types, including multiple choice questions, drag and drop activities, and performance-based items. The multiple choice questions may require either single or multiple responses, while the performance-based items assess your ability to solve problems within a simulated environment. Despite the fact that CompTIA Security Plus doesn't cover hands-on scenarios as much as BTL1 does, it still requires comprehensive study of broader cybersecurity topics to pass the exam. In BTL1, the exam is a 24-hour hands-on incident response test where you need to tackle and complete 20 task-based questions. You'll apply various tools learned in the course, investigate multiple systems, and recognize different tactics from the ATT and CK framework employed by the threat actor in the exam. A score of 70% on these questions is required to pass, and achieving 90% or higher on the first attempt earns you a BTL 1 gold coin. If you don't pass on the first try, there's a 10 day waiting period before you can take it again. Okay, so far we discussed the exam format and what course content each certificate focuses on. Now let's discuss the career impact and industry recognition of each. When you pass CompTIA Security Plus, you will have chances of landing a job in general entry level cybersecurity roles, such as security analyst, IT security specialist, or a security engineer. Remember that CompTIA Security Plus is widely recognized, often a baseline for cybersecurity roles, which means there is a broad salary potential depending on the role that you will have. On the other hand, passing BTL1 qualifies you to more in-depth roles in defensive security, such as Security Operations Center Analyst, Incident Responder, Threat Hunter. BTL1 is gaining a growing recognition in the Blue Team and cybersecurity community and its holder's salary may be slightly higher for specialized defensive roles. So after all this talk, which one to pursue? My advice is to start first with CompTIA Security Plus if you are completely new to cybersecurity. The concepts and foundations taught while studying to pass CompTIA Security Plus are necessary to learn for newcomers in cybersecurity. Don't underestimate CompTIA Security Plus because it's the standard that proves you have the foundations in cybersecurity. However, if you have a solid foundation in understanding security concepts and willing to level up to gain hands-on skills in cyber defense, then you can prepare for Blue Team Level 1 certification. All right, so that was it. 
I hope this was informative and don't forget to check out the write-up for this video in the description. Thank you.